Y'all were so quick to switch up. Y'all wanted to cancel him. And this woman says, yes, because you believe the victim first. Always. You ready for the mind? I'm ready. Believe the victim. How do we know who the victim is? You're inherently participating in the destruction of another person's life. You're actually attacking the victim. Today's topic, Rex Orange County, okay? Uh, if you don't know who Rex Orange County is, he's um, some kind of singer or whatever. He's a musician. His name is Rex Orange County. I just want to know what I'm talking about. Yeah, that's about. correct. Okay. I know. I thought that was a place in California. Yes. <laughs> Turns out it's an artist and people like him. So, man was being... Yo, welcome uh, to Longay, Quebec City. What is that? Oh, that's my new one, Monica. <laughs> Longay, Quebec. What's your name? Dade County? <laughs> <laughs> that's weird. <Sorry>. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, homie was being accused mm. of um, doing a lot of stuff to underage people. And as a result, he had to cancel a portion of his tour. He was dealing with that. And then he put out a statement today. Okay? Today, all charges of me against me have been dropped. The Crown Prosecution Services reviewed the evidence and decided that there's no merit in this case going to trial. Not guilty verdicts were entered to all the charges. I've always denied these, and I'm grateful that the independent evidence has cleared me of any wrongdoing. I have never done anything to anyone. I do not condone violence. I would like to clarify some details around what I was accused of, as I've not been able to address this until now. Inaccuracies about the case have been circulated. I was wrongly accused of touching someone one evening on their leg, neck, back. Puss in her crack. <laughs> hey, Ralph. This is not the time. I'm sorry. This is not the I'm time. I'm sorry. That's how my brain works. This is not the time. Bro, I'm <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I mean, don't... <laughs> Don't act like you don't know what the f you're getting into when uh, you talk with the I literally paused because I was <laughs> yeah, thinking the same song. Yeah. So, um, I would like to clarify some details. Uh, six charges. Okay, accused of touching them on their leg, neck, back, and bottom. That led to six charges. So, for every time they got, like, one charge. One charge. Ah! That's one. You remove your hand. My apologies, by the way. Yeah, you keep apologizing for that shit, but you keep doing that shit. What you mean? Hey, be, being very hands-on. Like this? Your motherfucking hands-on. Like this? You sound like, you know what you look like? <laughs> you know what you look like? You look that motherfucking movie with face on love and then prison. Was it Money Talks? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> when he started like telling the story, and he's, he's like, like, yeah, what happened? You gonna... We was at Chip Man from a little hot man, but I was just chilling, man. I was like, the cop gonna come up and pull behind me, he had the lights and everything. How did he grab me? Yeah, how did he grab me? <laughs> <laughs> like, like yeah. that? What they do? How they, they, do? they try to grab me like this, just jack me up, man. Like nah, it was like grabbing, man. It was right. tripping. They was trying to, they was slinging like, yeah, like that. Then they like grabbed, yeah. That? He's like, this? He's like, hey, get out of Yeah. Man, get the hell out of me, man. Run that, run that. I remember, I remember, I remember. I remember. <laughs> I remember. Uh, you know, I back in those dancing salsa too with a girl I did a practice, right? Today? Yeah, we're just before this. And like, I was grabbing her back because you don't have to grab her back. Yeah, 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 that's how you control it. And I think about like, man, in this, we just so comfortable. No, because it, it, it's certain things though. Like, I won't touch her lower back. It's, it's that there's certain things that are established. Yes. You know what I mean? Look, it's, it's established. I need to, when I need to lead you, I'm going to lead you with the hand on the back, this yeah. and that, depending on what you. There's some dances that are going to even work. I know you hate that dance, but I still dance it, right? Yeah. Kizomba, you're going to lead with your, you're going you're gonna to lead with your, with, with your hip, yeah. with your, with your hip bone, yeah. with your leg, yeah, yeah. with your shoulder, with, there's a lot of things that, you know, motherfuckers, are, I'm going to be in a motherfucker's box. Yeah. Pause. But I'm gonna be right yeah. in 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 there. So, it, but it's 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 established. Established. That it's okay. But then there's some people. You know, the back is very long, and they, you know. But in that kind of circumstance, even though I have all the free reign to grab her here, I might even do something here on the back. Yeah. Where she going under? Yeah. Right. Or I might just grab her here. And yeah. Have her turn. There's never a time where I could push her. There's never a time where I could. Play punch. That's not allowed in that context, right? No. Here between us, you push me all the time. You be like, yeah, but you don't like this, nigga. Shit. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I remember one time you pushed me so hard, I really felt like a kid. <laughs> but 
we have that understanding convention. It all depends on what the fuck you're saying. Because sometimes you be saying some stupid shit that matches the push. You understand what I'm saying? So when you finish doing that thing, which you knew exactly what the fuck you was doing. What was I doing? And I, I don't know what I the fuck. I said something funny. Some fucked up we shit or something it. funny. I whatever. Made you it, exactly. But so, I made you laugh so you, hard you but had to you, push you. But you, yeah, you know why I'm pushing you. You know exactly why I'm pushing you. But even so there's a we correlation. Don't understand that, even though we understand it, one thing we never do. Touch each other's face. Oh, my nigga. We in woo. I'm going to have to fuck you up. I'm right? catching 300 charges, but you catching like 50. No, I'm not. 50. No. And, and some of them are violent. No. The way I flew, I could have really hurt myself. That's because you're a bitch. Yeah, so? Bitches get protected. Welcome to the law. <laughs> okay? No, you catching charges. <laughs> Yeah. You can't just charge us. Let's carry on. Let's carry on. Uh, we take this time off. Just get, get right there. Hey. hey, go bad bitch. Hey. Go. We in court. You go to jail now. Hey, baby. But anyway, so go ahead. Six chart. Okay. The only evidence against me was the individual's account. However, CCTV footage obtained by the police contradicted their version of events. Their partner was also present throughout the entire <coughs> in question and gave a statement to the police, which did not support the allegations against me. It's been a difficult time for everyone involved. And I'd like to thank the people who've helped me through it as well as my family and loved ones for their continued support. Okay. So then you got video footage that contradicts what they said happened as well as their partner at the time who also said way what you said didn't happen. Okay. That's already a lot right there. This dude, by all intents and purposes, a lot of his fans had canceled him. A lot of his fans had said, we're not supporting you anymore when the allegations came out. And what struck me is when I went to the comment section of his fan base. Someone says, it's crazy to me how people are saying shit like the switch up on some people is going to be crazy. Like, when did it become wrong to change your opinion on a situation as the facts were brought to light? Yeah. The problem isn't that you change your opinion. The problem is that you had an opinion to begin with. If you don't know, just say you don't know. If someone makes an allegation against Peter, I don't know Peter and I don't know the person, unless they bring forth a bunch of evidence to support it, I'm like, I don't know. But if you just go, well, believe her, he's guilty. Oh, wait, he brought up evidence. Well, he's not guilty anymore. That's a backwards way of living life. Uh, Am I wrong about that? No, that's what you're saying. Oh, Nobody yeah. is switching up. Personally, as a woman, if, uh, if an comes out against one of my favorite artists no matter how it is i'm going to believe the victim until the artist is proven innocent a lot how a lot of motherfuckers function i want you guys to appreciate it. this is not innocent till proven guilty this is guilty till proven innocent that's yeah. how these people are literally operating yeah but as the court of the court of people the court of the people the court of uh, public opinion switch up is okay reminder to always believe the victim until proven otherwise <clears throat> listen if you guys are like that and you're in my i hope you guys leave now if that's how you really operate, you just believe anyone who says anything until proven otherwise, I hope I lose you guys. If I was this dude, I'd tell all these who ran like that and were running on this kind of mantra, I don't want you guys. That's me personally. That's, ugh. Ugh. And, and maybe you don't feel as strongly as I do. I don't feel as strongly as you do? I don't know. No, I don't know. For me, I find these kind of comments the most disgusting. I feel like people don't want to walk this earth without the feeling of not having an opinion it feels like there's a lot of people that they're like uh i have to have an opinion on everything which is something that's very impossible it's impossible to have an opinion on everything but you have to like i if, 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 sometimes the hardest thing that i found people to say was i don't know what would you think about this I, I I don't I don't know. We have to have an opinion on everything. You don't have to have an opinion on everything. People yeah. have to. They 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 have to viscerally have an opinion on everything whenever it's brought up to them. So whenever they see an artist like that, oh, they have to choose a side. No, you don't. Listen to this one. Y'all were so quick to switch up. Y'all wanted to cancel him, and this woman says yes because you believe the victim first always. I don't like breath. Just take a step back. Just take a step back. You don't have to call her a liar. You don't have to say you inherently believe him. You're like, I don't know. Until more information comes to light, I'm going to just keep it pushing because it really don't change much for me. And let me tell you guys, the only people who do this whole believe her nonsense are people who haven't been faced with an accusation that's untrue. Uh -huh. People who don't really want to accept that there are people that f***ing lie on a regular basis because it benefits them because they didn't want to tell their boyfriend they cheated on them because of the fact they just hated the guy or they couldn't handle rejection well or they got some f 
mental instability. I don't know why. There's a very vast reasons why people lie. But this idea that when it comes to allegations, all of a sudden, all of a sudden, you know what I'm saying? People want to do this whole thing where like, there's no way someone will lie. Like, yeah, what but block? it's only three percent of our allegations that are reported. Not aren't. Yeah, it's only three percent are reported. Reported. A bunch of them are not reported. And even when you come with CCTV, even when you come with the boyfriend saying like she lied, that didn't happen that way. There's still people who are not gonna believe. So understanding that, like, if you're watching this, just drop that whole mantra. There's it's a, whole... a bad thing, and it, honestly, it makes. A lot of people who are on the opposite end want to refuse to believe anyone, even when they come with evidence, yep. because they've seen so many people disingenuously believe folks like Amber Heard. Yeah. Okay? Uh-huh. Someone said this. Someone said this. You ready for the mind fuck? I'm ready. Believe the victim. How do we know who the victim is? Believe the victim. How do you know who the victim is? You want to know what it really means when they say believe the victim or believe it means just believe the woman because women apparently don't lie it inherently puts men in this position where men are always the bad guy because vast majority of the time i do not see this kind of energy ever afforded to supposed male victims no extra energy it, it happens in a blue moon but most of the time it's not it's not and this paradigm is just another way in which basically society tells men you're guilty of it irrespective of whether we believe you or not and this whole victim's like what if he's a victim what if it's his life being destroyed because some woman's a stalker someone's upset you're inherently participating in the destruction of another person's life you're actually attacking the victim yeah ain't that fucked up in your effort to believe the victim you're actually attacking the victim and you know what from his perspective it's very easy to become resentful if you lose a lot like he didn't he's fortunate cctv footage from years ago not easy for everyone to obtain not everyone has that luxury. That's what if it's two just people in a room? Her, his words against hers. If there is CCTV. And that life gets destroyed. This is when it ends well. Think about all the time it does it. You've participated in hurting victims. Yeah, but he's always a safe man. You don't know. If you're fine with hurting a bunch of people to help a bunch of others, what does that say about you? I'm curious. What does it say? That you're being used as some fucking tool by some people to do more evil. I don't know. It's just, it fascinates people who think they're doing this kind of virtuous thing. It's like, no, you're actually hurting people. You are hurting victims. So just think about that. Because when you're on the receiving end, and it doesn't go your way, and you got to live with that shit, you become angry. Resentful. That's a bit crazy, though. Yeah. Why? But it's just, it's it's painful. It's really what you said. All these motherfuckers, you really nailed, you never nailed, you you hit it on the head. Like, because... It's really motherfuckers that never face that. They don't know how traumatic it is to have someone say stuff like that or people saying stuff like that about you and then you have to defend. It's already fucked up to prove something like that to happen. Do you know how fucked up it is to prove something that did not happen? True. How hard that is. Now I'm here and I gotta prove to motherfuckers that some shit did not happen. I have to have evidence on things that is not. But no, you have to, you know, believe women. It's, it's women. Because that's what it is. Like you said. It, 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 it really is that. Think about that girl who ran around around here in our city, accusing a bunch of people. And then she got accused. And then all of a sudden she went, wait, I think we need to hear both sides. Yeah. Remember her? Yeah. Remember her? I remember her. As she switched up real, yeah, she real switched up fast real quick. when it was her turn. When she was. when And, 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 she, she, and she did. Because I saw. Yeah. She did. Yeah, I bet. I bet her comedy. Changed. But everybody, but everybody was like, but everybody was like, yeah, believe her, believe her, believe her. But she was doing the one doing the bad shit.